girl, you're a star. Come on and dance, baby. And dance, baby. Good morning. It is Friday, my day off. I picked today as my day off because August is about to be insane. So I figured let me close out the month with no work to do that is work related, but I have a lot to do that is personal life related. That's what is happening today. I'm currently editing the uh, vlog that's going up in the next, mm, hopefully hour. Later on today, we're going to meet up with Caleb TV. And then later on tonight, we're gonna meet up with Timbo and Clue. You should have, well, we haven't traveled in a while. So when would you have seen them? Timbo and Clue always go on the trips with me. So here's a clip of them in all their glory. <laughs> You done? Uh, not really. Right. Okay, I got yeah, everything. Get out. I'm done. They're aggravating, but they're my friends. I'm also gonna go to LA Fitness after I get this video up, but I'm not rushing into anything because I still want to enjoy my weekend. Also, I need to send those donations off, so I'm going to pack the car up with those as well. Yeah, it's gonna be a it's gonna be a day, one thing at a time. I don't know how long my camera is gonna stay on my decorative pillow like this. So my video is up and live. I am heading to LA Fitness, but while I'm away, because you know I don't really get a lot of gym footage and all of that, I figured I would leave my camera so my battery can charge. But I wanna show you some, some footage from the 23rd because I have some work news. So here it is, and I'll be back, and then we'll talk. <sighs> Hello, it's Friday. My work day is over just like 10 seconds ago. I had a meeting at like 4.10. I was in the middle of taking out my twist because my best friend and my best friend-in-law are in town. Um, they're in town for some conference or something and I was gonna meet up and go to dinner with them. But I had an impromptu meeting with my supervisor and he was like, let me know when you're free and call me on Teams. So I said, okay. And he was like, um, I just wanted to tell you that you're an underwriter. I got it. I got it. <sighs> I've been working so hard at this. And yes, I've been working in the dark because sometimes I do that. I don't need all this extra light on me for what, but I did it. I got it, I did it. Some of the quotes, you are a solid pick. Your name kept coming up. Um, this person and that person wanted you on their team. Um, we're happy that you're gonna start your new career within a new department, all of the things. We talked salary, of course. 90% um, of your salary was based on your qualifications. And I was like, mm -hmm. because I haven't been with the company that long, so you couldn't really base it off of what I've done within the company, but I have done a lot in the past 11 months. I haven't even been with the company a year yet. I did it. I worked for this. And I need to leave the house in like 20 minutes, but I gotta call my mom back now that I'm off work. Hey, babe. Hi, mom. I'm officially hey. off work now. It's on the right, sir. <laughs> yeah. But um, I'm uh, excited. Ooh. Yeah, that is nice. That is nice. 
I that did. That is the one that I you deserve it, girl. You deserve it. Yeah. He would go. Mm -hmm. And he, said he would have. Yeah, he did say he would have. So mm -hmm. I'm glad I wasn't being complacent and right. just right. in my head about it and worrying about other people's feelings. And I did tell him par partially um, tugging on my heartstrings was knowing that I would have new management and I would have to get to know someone else. But I do value the rapport that I've built with you. And he was just saying, oh, <laughs> but I, I worked so hard, not even yeah. just at this position, but at the other place for five years. How symbolic is this? This is the last page in my notepad that I use daily. Very symbolic. I just can't believe what today turned out to be. All right, fresh out the shower, ashy as can be, hair still dirty. I am getting myself together to go drop off my donations. I wanted to at least share the news with you. We did it, we did it, we did it. I'm an underwriter, you guys. Like, I have been so proud of me. You know, I put in the work, I did all of the things. Now the real work begins. I did it, I'm an underwriter. As of the 16th, but I mean, you know what I'm trying to say. I'm so proud of myself. That's all I can really say, I did it. That was another thing I was taking time to look on YouTube to see who else looked like me that was an underwriter in the vlogging space and I didn't see anyone. If you know any brown auto underwriters, property and casualty underwriters, let me know. I would like to see what, what they have going on on their channel. Not an insurance agent, not a loan officer, not a mortgage underwriter, a brown property and casualty underwriter. That's what I want to see. And I haven't found one. But if you know one, I would like to give them the views. My supervisor, I was so nervous because I thought that he was going to be upset. Not that, you know, you should care that much because you are in a professional setting. But this is someone that brought me into their department and I didn't even give you a year of my time. Sorry. I felt like if the department had said, yeah, let her do it. I feel like you guys had high hopes for me getting it. No, we can talk about that some more. If you have any questions in the comments about internal promotions or what I did during my interview or anything, let me know. This little number is from the elephant. I feel like I'm about to do a praise dance. The elephant jungle sanctuary. I got it in Thailand, so. There's that. I had to come back and tell you about what the fragrance of the day is gonna be, passe soir. We'll talk about it later, but I felt like since I'm celebrating this new career chapter, journey within the company, you know, I wanted to like, you know, I wanted to, I wanted to smell like new money. You know what I mean? All right, all right, okay, okay. Ooh, now that was intense. Passe soir smells so good. I don't even have that much left, okay. Wow, do you hear that? That's it, that's all I'm spraying. <laughs> so good. Here are the notes, here are the notes. I gotta go, I gotta go. I've never had a beer. I don't drink beer either. So you just gonna get one and complain about it. <laughs> Look at her. Ew. I need to turn it up. Why she won't just have one bag, Lord? What is this? <laughs> Why am I in the office? Hear me out. I don't like to be in here when I'm not actually working or doing working things. But hear me out. 
I have this feeling that they made the official announcement to the company today. I just feel like they did. If they didn't, then shame. Why am I on this computer? Okay, so that's reason number one. I just want to see the official announcement. Number two, I polished new nails in here the other day, so I needed to come in and get them anyway, so I figured why not kill two birds with one stone. Lots of emails, let's see. Um, good evening. I was right last night. The email came last night. Okay, okay, okay. Good evening. Please join us in welcoming the newest additions to the Personal Lines Underwriting Team. This group consists of external and internal candidates. We are proud to have them join our team effective August 16th. Once they're trained, they will help us too. And then they have the list of things. The first person on the list, they went in alphabetical order. The first person on the list, we actually mentored together when we first started working here. So that's really nice to see. So another person was in the hiring wave with me back in August of last year and then I'm at the bottom oh and this is the this is the uh, announcement that I gave to them I'm gonna read it the way they remixed it but anyway Syl is a graduate of Florida Agricultural and Mechanical University Tallahassee Florida she gained an invaluable amount of customer service experience from the Walt Disney World Company over the course of seven years her interest in underwriting stems from her role as an <clears throat> of over five years at her former employer. In such a short time in the department that I'm currently in, uh, she started her CPCU journey, mentored amazing new hires, and acquired her Yellow Belt certification. She is a Brooklyn-born Jamaican that loves traveling around the world. With over 15 countries stamped in her passport, she still has more food and languages to experience. I did it. Oh my goodness. And all three of us are going to be on the same team. The three, okay, the three of us that were in the the hiring wave back in August of last year, we're all going to be on the same team in our new department. This is so crazy. Wow. I was right. We got the email. Ah. Oh, yeah. Definitely celebrating tonight. Tonight is a night to celebrate. Personal lines underwriter. Welcome, new underwriting class. I feel like this is my probate. I really did it. I've been doing my gratitude log. Um, so I would write, I would write one line of gratitude, one line to manifest. And I did it for the law of attraction kind of challenge for two weeks. I've done it for over 70 days now. And I even chose a manifestation song. Am I getting emotional? Relax. Okay, the other day I looked back at some of the things that I wrote for manifestations and forgot that I even wrote those. Some I write more than once. And I'm going to share some of them with you. I even showed Kay when we were at the coffee shop my 2021 goals list. And she said, you can fill in this box right here, right? And I was like, yeah, I got two promotions in 2021. One within the department that I'm currently in and one outside of the department that I'm currently in. Initially, I thought my two promotions would be within my department, just moving up in the role that I'm in. But I should have thought bigger in a matter of weeks apart. Sometimes you have to just sit and take it in. Celebrate your wins, no matter how big or small. This one's pretty big for right now. What am I doing? I'm an underwriter. Wow. I did it.
What, what shirt you? Yeah, I didn't know y'all was on some like this is Africa. Did you buy it when you were in Africa? I know. This is actually um, Black History Month. Oh, ever heard? That's good. Man, I was buying like I support like six different companies. Like, this girl uh, actually went to talk, uh, Fam You. Wait, you say Black History Month? You never heard of that? <laughs> I was trying to remember what month it was, so it was February. The fact that <laughs> this Asian man is trying to tell me about Black History Month is beyond me. So these two oh, decided man. to invade someone's home. <laughs> but they are rattlers, so I guess it's fine. It's only right. I guess the keys were under the mat. Welcome to my crib. Lie again. MTV Cribs. The vlog has <laughs> the, the vlog has seen the housewarming. Stop. There's a vlog about it. Official like a ref with a whistle. This is Timbo. You've seen him before. Tell me y'all was on. What's, this what's is your shirt? What is that? TLC. Fuck. Damn. I can wear my Aaliyah. They already know. They do? I don't yeah. think they know. I'm gonna be an underwriter here. Yeah. I'm, I'm so proud of Syl. Oh, you have some people in town. What's her name? <laughs> I like regular strong. What do you think? Thanks. My mom went to meet 50 when he was in Clearwater with this shit. And you know what she was like? She was like, it's nice to meet you, Mr. Fitty. <laughs> Good afternoon. It's 4.23. I got up at 7.55, talked to my mom, rolled around a little bit, came down, had a bagel, had some water, had my vitamins. I don't know how it happened, but ended up back in the bed. Whoops. Then I saw 108 on the clock. <laughs> so my day's kind of just getting started for real. Not ashamed. I enjoyed my night. I miss going to the groove, but I love my health even more. So we were like on the outskirts. They gave us masks before we entered. The Panasonic makes it very trying to enjoy the things you once used to enjoy. It feels like a Sunday. So what I'm gonna do today, I'm going to deep clean my fridge. I'm not even gonna show you that. Once I deep clean the fridge and um, wipe down the countertops, all that stuff, I will feel more inspired to get back in the kitchen. I also need to figure out why my autofocus isn't autofocusing. Because if that whole clip was blurry, guess what? I'm not redoing it. So just walk away and let it play so you can hear it. It's not even evening at this point. It is 8.45 p.m. I figured I would at least let you know what I've done for the remainder of the evening. I never really, I don't think I've ever shown this angle. Have I shown this angle before? I might show you this angle more moving forward. I don't know, let me know. This is my kitchen. Mm -hmm. I feel like isn't cleaned until I do the floors and I light a candle, but I don't have a candle down here right now. I'm not doing the floors until tomorrow when I know that, you know, the natural light and everything can help um, dry it a lot faster. I want to just decompress, so I'm going to make some tea. I thought about making a drink just, you know, to still be in the celebratory mood, but I just want some tea. And I want to watch something on YouTube, Hulu, Netflix, you know, one of those. And I'm not going to get any bubbly until my first day in the new role. When I'm celebrating my wins at work, I like to have a little bubbly. This time I would like to do it after the first day. I feel like I would, I would feel a lot better doing that. Something else I wanted to touch on, anyone that has a glass top stove, I follow Vanessa, the queen of clean on TikTok. And when she put this up months and months ago, I saw it. So, and I'm sure that she's talked about it in the past, but 
easy off even though it says oven cleaner heavy duty i use this maybe twice a month there might be times where something spills onto the stove and the stove is still hot so by the time you come back to it it's already caked on or something like that but you might need a little bit more elbow grease so i use this twice a month i just cover my nose turn my vent on spray this down go do 10 other things come back wipe it down good as new just be careful and don't use it too often because it is for a deep clean and not for an everyday clean <laughs> I realized I didn't end the vlog, so sorry. I ended up filming, editing, and posting a video yesterday, so Sunday just was a YouTube day for me and after I put everything away I made sure I got my video squared away and posted that so that's why I didn't get back on I didn't say anything I wanted to say something now thank you for celebrating my promotion with me now you know I am going to be a PNC underwriter as of August 16th can't wait to see what's in store. The new challenges and new work begins. And now I need to start a new vlog. Thank you for spending some time with me and I will see you in the next one.